the phone. What the f huh? Our gang, what freaky twin thing? <laughs> Welcome back to our channel. So, I know you guys are wondering what the heck is Rebecca about to do? Well, I am at Buffalo Wild Wings, and Rachel is about to get great. So I told Rachel, let's film a mukbang <laughs> for the channel. So, I have a fake roach. <laughs> I'm gonna put her in her food and let's see what her reaction will be. <laughs> Rachel, you got a Buffalo Wild Wings. Yay, I can't wait to tear it up. I've been craving this for like three months. All right, so there is no outside seating, so we're gonna have to do the mukbang in a car. Yeah, it's okay. I have a good place to set up on the dashboard. Man, Rachel, I'm excited to do this mukbang with you. Hey, y'all and our gang, what freaking twin thing? <laughs> Welcome back to our channel. If you're new here, smash the subscribe button down below and hit the notification bell because, because we post two videos every single week. All right, so today, guys, we've been wanting to bring you guys a mukbang for so long. Yes. Delicious wings coming at you live. So I have to go to work in about 25 minutes. <laughs> so we're gonna smash this food really quickly. Oh, Ooh, Rachel, let's show me what to get first. Ooh. Ooh. So we have buffalo hot wings and Asian zing with potato wedges. Rachel, I can't. I can't with life right now. I'm just. I can't. I can't. I'm so hungry. Is the potato wedges in there? Yeah, right there next oh. to it. Bruh. All right, all right, all right. right. Okay, first off, did you bring the sauces? Yes. Okay, so what about our drinks? Oh, shoot, no more. You brought the drinks on the, the place? Yeah. Girl. I, I was thinking that I could suck down some coffee. And all right, now, let's just, do you mind if you just run inside real quick to get some drinks for that? All right, fine. All right, all right. let's just do a quick, a quick, uh, I hope that noise isn't too loud. Mm. Alright, let me go get some um, Diet Coke or something. Yeah. That thing's bomb. Mm. That's fire. Alright, come right back. Alright, just get one big cup so we can just share. I was thinking that, girl. Oh. I'm cheap. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> you guys, I literally have been on fire. Oh my god, I am too good. Yo, I'm the queen of pranks. I comment down below, Team Becca. You guys already know I'm about to. She's gonna freak out. All right, all right, all right. Relax. So I have the fake roach. I'm gonna put the roach. Maybe I should put it like. I'm gonna put it in the, this part. I cleaned it. I made sure and cleaned it. I sanitized the roach. And I'm gonna put it right under here. Put it like I'm gonna put it like right under here. So as soon as she like picks up that little piece, bam, bam. There's a roach. Put it right here. Comment down below. Are you a a drums? Or are you a wing person? Stand out. Looks nice and hidden. Let's see what she says when she gets back. <laughs> I'm gonna steal another fry too. I'm disrespectful. Bruh, bruh. Where's my phone? In my purse. Girl. Home girl. Mm -hmm. Girl, she's like, okay, I'll get your or I'll get your cup. One minute. She goes in the back for like five minutes. Get stuck with the other people who's sitting in the counter. Like sitting or um at the thing. And just leaves you without your cup. And I'm like, where's my cup? And then so she gives me a small when I spell a large. And then she charged me three dollars and twenty cents. I was like, well, that's the difference between a large. She goes, oh, the large is three oh nine. Me the damn large. Wow. And then she took another five minutes to just get me. I'm like, just get me. Anyways, let's do this. Let's you know see. what? Bruh. Oh, what you want to do first? You know, I know exactly what your favorite type of wings is garlic. Well, I like hot wings, but. I no, I'm talking about your favorite uh, style of wings. Well, um, This? No, I said that the drums are your favorite. Oh, is this a drum my favorite? Yeah. But I want this. Mm. <laughs> okay, so I thought you were gonna go with your favorite wing first, but I guess not. Mm. Mm, ding. I should have waited for you, bro. You should. I'm sorry. So disrespectful. I'm so hungry. Now I only have like five minutes for work. Oh my god, this is so good. Mm. I can't even think straight. Mm. Mm. What am I talk about? 
I know, I'm not gonna ask you what you wanna talk about, because I already know what you wanna talk about. <laughs> Rachel's been literally on my butt. About Dre. About Dre. Girl. Girl, everybody's gonna be on your butt. Comment on your below. They're gonna be like, we comment down below on your other videos too. Mom. Mm. Mm. I'm still hungry. Let's talk about dating in, um, in 2020. Mm. Well, well, it's my dating in 2019. You know what's crazy to me? What? That I feel like, I don't know, it's feel like it's so hard. Like, I feel like it's so hard for people now to find the one now. Mm-hmm. And I'm so grateful that, you know, God willing, that, you know, we found each other so early. Yeah. I don't know, I feel like as you age, is it harder as you age? It's or a combination easier. between, I think as you age, it's better because you are you know what you want more. Mm -hmm. And you're more mature. So, you don't react to things that, um, the same as you're a kid. You may overreact to things when you're a kid, but... As an adult, you kind of like handle it more maturely. Mm -hmm. But I feel like social media made it harder for mm -hmm. dating because mm -hmm. people have too many options. Mm -hmm. I like that. Mm -hmm. And then with like music and the culture now, you know, mm -hmm. women ish, men ish. Mm -hmm. So both sexes are like trying to like go against each other instead of like finding love. It's mm -hmm. more about. Popping up and getting money, you know. Right. So it's it's definitely harder. So I like, I feel like for me it's it's more of a. Do you also feel like because of your profession or your career choice, like your career choice is not like a it's like a, a middle middle to high SES choice. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So those, those type of guys that's in real estate, do you feel like they're more narcissistic, self-centered? So it's like harder to find in that way too? That is a good question. That's actually a huge one because I live in Fort Lauderdale and no long, no no offense to people in Fort Lauderdale or oh man, but I was running into very like lots of like narcissistic men mm -hmm. where they kind of just treat women like objects, right. you know? So I think it's harder in when you're in business, but especially because like I'm in business, so my time is so limited mm -hmm. that I don't have time for the games, you know? Mm -hmm. And also like, you have to be a little bit self-centered to have a successful business because you have to like, you have to cater to yourself. Mm -hmm. And in order for you to have like a successful relationship, you have to sacrifice your time and it's not sacrifice, but you know what I mean. So you have to give up some of your time to like grow the relationship. So that means I'll have to sacrifice some of my business time. Mm -hmm. Some I work, I work all the time. So I have to be very careful with who I get with because I'm going to have to be like pouring into that person, mm -hmm. you know? Mm -hmm. So, who knows? I do like the hot better. Yeah. Mm -hmm. God, this is so. It's fire. You um. You can have the last garlic over there. I think that's your that's your favorite type of wing, right? I need the one and um, one. Oh, you can eat the other one. I want that piece, Rachel. But it's it's fine. What the? No. <laughs> <laughs> you almost broke my finger. Ah! <laughs> Where is it? Rachel. Oh my god, did you kill it? It was a break. <laughs> what? How? What happened? 
Ow. What happened? That was the most painful prank. Ow. It was a prank? It was a <laughs> It was a prank? <laughs> oh my god. Back let me see your finger. No, you broke your foot. I broke your foot too. <laughs> What the Did you jump out to me? <laughs> I don't know what happened. I don't know. What happened. I don't know what happened. I don't do bugs, girl. Look at some of that drink. Oh my god, jump! Bruh, you took me all the way out, girl. We're so focused on the conversation, girl. You curse. You never curse, boy. How to get rid of the curse boy puts a roach in her food, okay? <laughs> oh, I that's panicked. too funny. I panicked. Oh my goodness, that was so funny, girl. <laughs> and you left me with the roach. Becca, you weren't getting us to throw it out the window. You ain't throwing it out the window. Bro, I was like, nah, I'm not, the, I'm not about to waste this good of food with a <laughs> fake roach. You got me on the I did. That was good, bro. That was so good. Dang. Wait, why am I holding random baby snacks? <laughs> <laughs> That is it for today's video. We really hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share. Bye. What freaking twin thing? What freaking twin thing?